Hey everybody, it's P-Dubs, and you know I love multicades, and guess what? When it comes to the Polycade Sente, that's right, these modular multicade arcade machines that went up on Kickstarter earlier this year, looks like they're going to start shipping next week. Okay, guys, we are back. That's right. Polycade did provide updates on both their Kickstarter update page, their website, as well as on their Discord channel. I'll have links to all those in the video description below if this is a product you're interested in learning more on, or if you potentially have a pre-order like me and you're eagerly awaiting getting your pre-order. Polycade was nice enough to share various videos as well as pictures, which I'm going to show you in this video highlighting where they're at with the current production of the machines and we actually get to see a bunch of these things on the assembly line for instance right here you do have a the polycade sentes you get to see them in both black and white i myself did pre-order a black version i really didn't want a bright white arcade cabinet so i'm actually excited that this black arcade cabinet looks pretty cool in my opinion like up here you see a little spot for a camera down here you have uh the light up logos Behind the machine, you'll notice that it lights up as well. And of course, taking a look here at the machine, it's got the keyboard uh, slides out. If you ordered and you're going to use their gaming PC, unless you're going to plug in your own PC. This particular unit has the two player controls modular panels plugged in. If you want to play two players, again, this is a modular arcade machine. They're going to be selling all different kinds of control panels. They have various trackballs and things like that. Also, what's really interesting is we got to see some cool little videos here. So taking a peek here, this is the actual assembly happening in their warehouse. You'll notice that they are diligently getting these machines assembled and ready for people. So it was pretty cool that they shared this. Again, I, I wish people would hold their phones in landscape mode, but I guess a lot of people do vertical mode for TikTok and things like that. Now, what we also have here is a pretty cool video that actually shows you a fully assembled and lit up one on one of its stands. So if you were one of the customers who, ap who happened to order the stand, let's take a peek right here for you guys. So if you ordered the stand, let's go ahead and watch this video together. This is what the Polycade is going to look like on the stand. I did not order the stand. I'm just going to wall mount my unit directly behind me. That's right. We've talked about this before on prior streams. I'll be making a change to some of the machines here behind me. I'll probably be moving stuff around the house, and I'm going to probably have this Polycade Sente mounted on the wall behind me. Because, again, in my office is where I prefer to keep my multicades. But taking a peek here, you'll notice this is kind of what it looks like if you also have the optional graphics on the sides, as well as if you have this on the stand. And in my opinion, although the renders and stuff make it look silly, Actually, I think it's pretty tolerable. I mean, it kind of reminds me of like some of the more modern arcade machines you'd see in a Dave & Buster's. Yeah, there's not really a lot of nostalgia behind the artwork and the way the machine looks. But then again, we also got a bunch more photos. So let's kind of take a peek here. This is the unit on a stand before the control panels are put in. And you'll kind of notice in here, if you kind of scroll in, I think that Polycade, that white box there, might be the mini gaming PC that comes included. You'll see where you have all the framing for where all the wiring is going to go. Hopefully, it's going to end up being a nice, clean-looking install once that happens with these. You'll see right here, these are the, uh, if you did pick the option that includes the gaming PC, this will be the gaming PC specs that's included with your purchase. Keep in mind, the AGS software will also be preloaded on there as well for you again right here this is all the different specs for the arcade machine itself all the different audio you got a headphone jack power port what kind of power point usb-c hdmi 2.0 several usb ports bluetooth capability supports bluetooth 5.2 wi-fi uh different storage you got one terabyte storage on the gaming pc if you pick the unit with the gaming pc 16 gigabytes of RAM, all that stuff, AMD, Radeon, graphics, etc. This particular gaming PC should be have the ability to run a lot of games, including Mortal Kombat uh, 11 and things like that. So a lot of modern games and obviously your retro games you're not going to really have an issue with. Taking a peek here now on this particular um, assembly line. This was just a funny photo of one of the workers with his glasses on showing you that he's getting this stuff assembled. And it's always fun to kind of see stuff like this. You kind of see the magic in action. All these particular panels wrapped in plastic, getting ready to get uh, packaged up. 
Everything getting shrink wrap, shrink wrapped and put on pallets and crates. These look like completed machines that they're getting ready to load on the boats and send out to people. Here's some more pictures of some machines that need to be shrunk wrap, as you can see right here. And then taking a peek here, just more parts as they're going through and getting at least the first 50 units assembled with many more units to come. And as you can see here, you got your various control panels as well. This one looks like it's got the hole in it. So people who maybe ordered the trackball are getting that control panel. It's nice to see that these products are making their way. Now, when exactly are these products going to be shipping to you? So let's take a peek here for you guys. So over on their Kickstarter page, they did announce uh, on June 11th, a couple days ago, that production has begun. Tyler himself, who runs the show over there, he, went, he was there inspecting the units. He was at the factory. And check this out. The first 50 units will ship next week. And th these units are mostly going to be handpicked people who are on the West Coast. Uh, aside from these parameters, they also selected them in the order that they were received. I myself happen to be on the West Coast, and I did get an email <coughs> saying that, hey, we're getting ready to ship your orders. So I have a feeling I might be one of the lucky 50 who might be getting my uh, Polycade Sente very, very soon. Keep in mind when they mean shipping next week, they are going to go ahead and they are going to ship uh, from overseas. So as you can see right here, the first batch is going to ship by sea. It's going to hop on a boat, hopefully make it to the United States around the 10th, hopefully clear customs within a couple days, and they're going to schedule the delivery. They're going to call you to schedule your delivery. Earliest delivery is expected July 16th, but you never know what can happen between here and here and also getting through the ports. Now, I know this particular product wasn't for everyone because it did have a higher price tag than a lot of the other stuff that we've seen in our home arcade community. A lot of people prefer to see arcade machines for 500 bucks or less. But taking a peek here, this is a, a full-fledged multi-cade that's got supposedly a decent gaming PC. We'll have to test it out when we get it, see if it was worth the extra markup on the on the uh, on the unit. And obviously, metal construction. This these things are made out of steel, not plastic. They're larger, they're heavier. You got the screen in there. Yeah, you got a 1080p screen, I believe. You got supposedly good sound system in here as well. So I know this wasn't a good product, or I know this wasn't a very popular product. Uh, on my particular channel, but I pre-ordered one and I'm excited to check it out. And I'm definitely going to share my experience and let you guys know what I think, just in case they happen to put like a big sale on Polycade Sentes in the future, things like that. It'd be nice to have some content out there um, from people in our community sharing our experiences with this Multicade Arcade. I love Multicades and hopefully I don't feel like I wasted my money once I get this thing and get to play with it. Definitely want to know what you guys think about the Polycade Sente and the latest news. People are going to start seeing them hopefully by next month, and they're supposedly going to be shipping out next week and heading on that long trip across the ocean to here in the United States. Give me your thoughts, feedback, reactions below, and if you enjoyed this quick news video, do me a favor, give me a thumbs up on the way out, and as always, my dudes, thank you for subscribing.